Some local elementary school students were able to get a unique opportunity during school today. Eyewitness News 3's Braden Wilson tells us how it left an impression on these students. Students at Teton Elementary School have been racing to the moon for the past school year. They are running, walking, cycling, or swimming the distance from Earth to the moon. People from all over the world donate their miles to help them reach their goal. I've always been very interested in astronomy and we've been incorporating it to a lot of our classes like STEM, um, in our own home classrooms. The class goes out and does uh, laps around the school and sometimes we'll do it in the gym and it's just fun for everybody to run and walk around the school and do stuff at home and see all the different countries and states that we get putting miles in. As a part of the experience, students had a chance Monday to meet with an astronaut over Zoom. He told them what it's like to be in space. One student shared how astronauts brush their teeth. They have these like little bags with a straw and they have water in them and like they like blow some water out and it like floats there and so they can and then they like brush their teeth and spit it out into a paper towel afterward huh. and throw it away. They also learned how astronauts eat in space. They had to have like a table and they had to tape stuff but sometimes they got used to it so they just let it float away. Not like float away but like like let it float there and then they could just grab it. Many of the students said meeting with the astronaut is something they won't soon forget. I think it was cool and like how like it wor worked like and how they make it phys physics kind of work out in space and how he could like move in space and all these videos and I think it's cool that he just gave us a chance to see it. It was really cool because it seemed like it was a video but it was real so I was kind of excited because I've never seen an astronaut or like really seen videos and that the fact that we got to talk with one. That was kind of cool. Many of the students said they felt inspired to find a way to get into space, either by becoming an astronaut or an aerospace engineer. In Teton, I'm Braden Wilson.